Okay, today's adventure is going to be with the dump trailer again. This time we are going to go clean out a house. Um, the renters that were there before um, left a lot of stuff. They're not coming back to get anything, so the man that owns it uh, is going to be there. He's going to help clean it out. Um, I'm going to my buddies. We're just going to haul the stuff to, uh, to the dump for him, so let's get to it. All right, so that's Josh. He's here. He's going to be helping. Uh, his dad and him are the ones that's uh, got this place. They're going to be doing a complete remodel uh, as they've already started tearing down some of the walls and pulling the ceiling out. So take a quick walk through. All this stuff goes. This is all dumpster stuff. Uh, and as they're knocking walls out, they will be or will be hauling it away too. So. There's another room. There's some of the stuff that they've already taken out. This will all go. Complete gut and remodel. Upstairs here, little kitchen. This will all go. Everything. Little bathroom here. Another bedroom here. This room isn't too bad. Another little room, and then back out to where we started here. This thing, this, uh, this house also has a basement. Um, we'll be cleaning it out too. There's not a whole lot down there, but uh, I figure we get a couple loads out today and uh, really open this place up. So, yep, we'll get set up and let's get to it. Load number two. Let's go see progress. Hi, John. Hello. Hi, Josh. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't look like much, but we're able to move around. Got a scrap pile here, metal. And basically, some of this drywall and stuff out of this room. The rest of the house looks the same. We'll take a walk down to the basement, see if you can see down there. Uh, and they got to clean this up. 
down here. So, bunch of stuff. The water down here, this basement has been flooded all the way up to that ring right there. So, got a lot of stuff back in here that needs to be cleaned out. They are actually going to get me another load. Ah, mother. Oh. Oh. Watch out for the pipe. Oh, didn't even see it. Anyway, I'll leave that in the video. Hmm. Anyway, so they're going to get us another load gathered up, and we'll be back here in the morning and finish this up. Get some more out of here. So, let's get this load in. All right, I tried videoing a couple times there whenever I was dumping. Uh, that way you could see all the trash coming out of the bed of the trailer, but uh, my uh, camera mount wouldn't hold, and it kept falling off. Um, so, hauling, hauling junk with a dump trailer you know, debris, you know, housing debris, whatever. Um, I went and priced out, uh, this is actually the reason I bought my dump trailer because I was remodeling the house. And uh, I have some numbers here from, uh, th uh, you know, two different places that I called for dumpster rental. Some of them are sister companies, so it's the exact same people that I talked to already. Um, so, two different places. One charges uh, $495.00. The other one is $525 for a 20-yard roll-off dumpster. And you only get it for three days uh, for that price. Um, after the three days, it's $10 a day after that. Uh, that price includes bringing it, dropping it off. Um, you, you fill it. Uh, and then they come and pick it up and haul it to the dump site. Now... You only get three tons. That's what three tons of material costs. And it doesn't take long to get three tons in one of those dumpsters. After that, they charge $75 a ton. So if you was to have, you know, a ton is 2,000 pounds. So let's say that you had, I don't know, if, if the dumpster on an average was 500 bucks uh, and you got it done in three days, and they want to charge you $75 a ton, and you were three and a half tons. They're going to charge you a whole extra ton of 75 bucks. So that just turned into $575. And if you threw a microwave or a, a refrigerator or a tire or whatever in there, they're going to dock you and charge you for that, which was extra money. And uh, I think it was 10 or $15 per appliance uh to get rid of it tires i think were 25 bucks a piece or something something crazy uh but with me using my dump trailer this here's something else that somebody might think about if you have a dump trailer and you're watching this video uh rent that thing out take it out drop it off uh you know give them a three or a five day minimum you know whatever uh they can load it make sure it's loaded uh level that way you can tarp it uh, you, you take it in, you drop it off, you know, put a tongue lock on it or pull the, pull the receiver off of it or the hitch off of it, whatever. Um, you know, that way it's secure. They can load it. Uh, you're not tearing up somebody's driveway, uh, or asphalt or whatever. It's not going to sink in and break everything up. They can load it. You go back and pick it up, haul it off to the dump. Uh, for me to dump that trailer is $51, uh, each time. So, uh, you know, it caught, I took two runs in today. That was 102 bucks. Um, you know, pay yourself, you know, pay yourself with that. Uh, so, you know, you could actually rent your dump trailer for three days for like 250 bucks, you know, and they don't even have to mess with it. And only thing you got to do is take it in, drop it off, go pick it back up, throw the tarp on it, run it to the dump site, dump it, pay for it, come back home. You know, maybe even drop it off somewhere else at another location or right back where it's at for $200. Put it right in your pocket. So it's kind of easy uh, to make a little money there. But today was done for my buddy. So when he runs uh, or watches this video, he knows what he owes me. And, uh, you know, that's the way it is. 
Hopefully everybody likes my content on the video. Uh, I'm kind of running out of things to talk about. Don't know what you guys want to see or whatever. So definitely leave some comments uh, on this video. Tell me a video that you're wanting me to make. Um, you know, ask questions, leave comments, hit the bell, you know, like, subscribe, do all that good stuff. And, uh, you know, it is coming up on, uh, what is what is the holiday coming up, baby? President's Day. No. What's tomorrow? Valentine's Day. That's what it is. Tomorrow's Valentine's Day. So don't be watching this with your woman unless she likes me and then, you know, it'd be all right. You can watch it then. So I'll play a little Valentine's music here at our toward the end. So until the next time, guys, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, hit the bell. Leave some comments, ask questions, share my videos, and uh, we'll catch you on the next one. Have a good Valentine's Day, guys.